Have you ever wondered why certain animals are found exclusively in Asia while others are native to Australia? Meet the Wallace Line, an invisible boundary that divides the unique species of these two continents. In the 19th century, British naturalist Alfred Russell Wallace noticed a striking difference in animal species distribution between nearby islands. He observed that islands like Bali and Lombok had Asian species, while nearby islands like Sulawesi hosted a mix of Asian and Australian species. This led Wallace to propose the existence of an invisible barrier, now known as the Wallace Line, running between these islands. To the west of this line, you'll find animals like tigers and elephants, which are typical of Asia. To the east, creatures like kangaroos and marsupials dominate, which is a characteristic of Australia. So what causes this ecological divide to exist? is the Earth's geological past. The ancient supercontinent Gondwana was separated entirely from other parts of the world after Penagia broke up. Australasia and its smaller islands were part of Gondwana and that is why their fauna is so different from that of Southeast Asia. The Wallace Line marks where part of the old Gondwana plate touches part of the old Laurasia plate. It showcases how geographical barriers have shaped the evolution and distribution of species across continents. It's a fascinating testament to the power of Mother Nature in creating our planet's incredible biodiversity. For more such interesting content, subscribe to our channel now. Unacademy. Let's crack it.